What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today is episode 5 of the No Money Spent series and today we continue our work through to Wilt Chamberlain in Unlimited. Open up a few of the Unlimited tier boxes that we get and open around 25 free packs from Unlimited, uh, Triple Threat, Triple Threat Online and just doing challenges throughout the way. We also go and get Daryl Griffith's Diamond Card. It was the Lifetime Agenda that came out a few days ago. He had to complete around 9 Lifetime ag ag Agendas to get him and we finally get him. You'll see that throughout the episode. And we also do a locker code at the end for a free prime pack. So make sure you guys stick around to the end. With the tokens that we have left over, we had around 37 to begin today's episode. We get Serge Ibaka. Very, very excited to get him. Uh, it's been quite a while since I've had a proper shooting center. So we unlock him and he'll be our starting center for quite a little bit. Now you can see here, Sapphire tier is completely done and we are onto the Ruby tier. Uh, it means we have our Sapphire box to open up. We get six cards here. The first five um, are opening on the screen right now we get Rick Mahorn and Russell Westbrook's not too good uh, nothing very important right there and to finish off we get the Sapphire player which we get Jermaine O'Neal which actually isn't too bad a shooting power forward center not too bad at all we get 15 tokens from a challenge and I decided to go and buy Duncan Robinson not only for XP but to add him to my lineup and on top of this we also pick up Darius Miles now these prices were from a few days ago so they are a bit more expensive or a little bit cheaper now I should say I um, mean you can say we add those two boys to the collection and add those guys to the team. You can look at the team here. It is getting better gradually. Uh, we do swap out Evan Fournier for Duncan Robinson. He's actually got a higher dunk tendency than Derek Rose's diamond. So that's something to take into consideration. I'll show you guys a dunk of his later on. And you can see adding in Darius Miles. That is what our lineup is looking at at the moment. Uh, now starting off here, as I said before, Duncan Robinson casually in traffic uh, after getting a steal, I should say, in traffic. Slams home a cheeky 360. So very, very happy about that. Serge Barker and his debut game also smacking away the ball there. Mitchell Robinson's defense is always very, very prevalent inside. I absolutely love it. And Kevin Love here. Just watch this screen from Kevin Love. Absolutely bang, knocking Kyrie out of the way there. It leads to the wide open Darius Miles shot. We don't green it, but we will make it. And that is the Ruby tier completed. Another um, another box, another Ruby tier box to unlock onto the Amethyst tier. We have eight cards to open up, which we'll do right here. Uh, the uh, It's the tier box from Ruby tier. We collect five Bulls players. You can see in the bottom left corner there. Uh, once again, getting through these lifetime achievement genders is very, very good for us. Sharif Abdul-Rahim and Scotty Pippen, Richard Jefferson. We get to throw those three players from the box as well as getting, I think it was Mouse in the House. And we also get an Air Force One High lower badge, a lower body badge and another uh, badge card there. We sell off a few injury cards. I've, I've kind of taken that consideration. Someone mentioned that a few episodes ago to sell them off. It is very important that I do that to make a bit of MT on the side. We get up to level 21. The reward for level 21, I'm pretty sure it was a shot. I know it was a it was a driving pack. I'm not sure what sort of reward it was, but we get the Ascension board for Marcus Johnson. Uh, people don't like his jump shot at all. It's it's not the highest jump shot three-point rating in the world, but I still would love the card just to add to my lineup or just to have for bragging rights. I'd love to have it in the collection. All of the, uh, all of the Ascension cards throughout the next few seasons would be absolutely amazing. We've got five picks here. We're already sitting on two fouls. We're on the top board. You can see here we're just getting MT after MT. We do get a double uh, value of the next token or MT card, which is good to add another pick. We get to 500 MT, double that up to 1,000. And with our final pick, we go, we just get randomized around the court and we get 250 MT. So not getting Marcus Johnson just yet, but we do have a few more chances down the line. Now, from Triple Threat, we do unlock Ruby Anthony Simmons. Uh, that was playing, I think it was winning 50 games. I'm not too sure. I think it was winning 50 games. So Anthony Simmons uh, looks like an all right card to use. And uh, I thought I may as well get all these starter cards out of the way. Uh, I complete Donovan and Mitchell's um, athletic upgrade. Um, this was while I was actually doing um, the Daryl Griffiths challenge, I'm pretty sure. Uh, now, Evoing Mr. Donovan Mitchell means we are on to our final starter, which is, unfortunately... Nikola Jokic. Um, I have used this card, obviously, after recording all this footage. I have used this card, and it is by far the worst starter. Uh, by far the worst starter. We do unlock Emerald Daniel Griffith. And by the way, if you haven't used this card, or you haven't bothered to do these cards, highly recommend it. It's a very, very nice card to have. Not only the Emerald and the Ruby, but the Diamond is very, very nice. I'm pretty sure it's got 95 driving dunk, and he's got four finishing Hall of Fame badges, which is very, very nice as well. Uh, now, going through uh, our triple threat rewards, we get a 
deluxe or just a regular standard league pack. You actually get two of them there. I think one with them was from a, a challenge a while ago. We're not getting anything really good here, but it's still adding to the collector level. Now we get Ruby, Daryl Griffith. I'm not going to show you like the way that I got all these done. You can stack the challenges. You know how to do the challenges. I'm not going to show you how to do them. I'm just showing you that I actually did do them. And now we are onto the Ruby. You can see here we're getting more of these challenges done. We get the Colossal Pack from doing his challenges. And uh, we, uh, we don't get any luck. You know us. We get Ben Simmons, uh, which is pretty disappointing. He's uh, he's probably not going to have a job at the end of this season, end of this offseason. But anyway, we, we uh, we're digress. We continue on. We got the badge, a diamond, uh, dime, I should say, gold diamond badge there, which is very nice. Another Colossal Pack uh, from more challenges. We get Jeff Hornacek. Uh, probably won't be good. I'm still on the lookout for a, for a holo card. I'd really love a holographic card. Um, if you've been noticing the daily challenges recently, as we do get diamond, Daryl Griffith there, uh, which we'll unbox in a second. But if you've noticed, across a few of the daily challenges recently, you've needed a holographic card to do them. So I really am on the lookout. I might go buy one after I record this video. Just a real cheap gold one. Just so I can have that on the side. Just so I can do those challenges and not miss out on the next P. Uh, but anyway, we've got a deluxe reward pack here. Open that bad boy up and we only get Brad Davis. Um, we got a sharpshooter pack that is once again from doing those Daryl Griffith challenges. It's a very difficult name to say. Um, we got a hot zone hunter badge, which is pretty good. But here it is, the diamond. I'm very, very excited. Nine challenges. Took a few hours, but Daryl Griffith is here. I keep stuffing up his name. Daryl Griffith. There we go. Shooting guard, Western Conference, number 35 from the Utah Jazz. 92 overall, Daryl Griffith. Now, this card, people don't like him because he's small. He's 6'4 at the shooting guard position. However, this year in my my team speed at least for season one speed is very important and i love having him on the fast break he's very very speedy and using him in his debut we end up getting through the amethyst tier and getting the 10 pack box which is very very exciting people don't like the rewards i'm not a huge fan of them i think they could be a little bit better but overall quite happy with it we get our free agent card there and we unlock level 23 so we're, we're gradually getting there. There's people that are like 10 levels higher than me already. I, I've been grinding multiple. I've been, I've been grinding my main account, my no money spend account, and playing park and rec. So I've been doing a lot of things recently, but we opened up this Amethyst box. I'm gradually getting there with XP. I will get there. I will get Carmella. We get Arvidas the bonus, which if you've seen previous episodes, I do not like that Arvidas the bonus card. He cannot finish inside. But we unlock another Amethyst here, as well as Kenny Smith, but another Amethyst card, uh, which is guaranteed with the Amethyst tier box. So number 24 from the New Orleans Pelicans. Unfortunately, I did think that I already had him on this team, Jamal Mashburn, uh, as you can see there, but I actually had him on my main squad. He was one of the first cards that I put in my main squad, uh, so I'm pretty lucky to get him here. He can be a nice card to use in domination and other things like that. Now, a standard league pack, we get Kyle Kuzma. A bit more footage from in-game. I was very happy with this pass, by the way, and a little behind the back there. This guy was running Isaiah Thomas, the poor bloke, um, and we, we managed to manage to win that game, um, but obviously people will improve their lineups as they go along long now uh, this came out i think last night um from when i'm recording this video is a prime time locker code now you can see what i'm aiming for here the bottom bottom right the bottom what happens what yeah we um we're not going to talk about that we're not going to talk about how i uh i managed to hit the one little little pokey up bit that made me hit get tokens but unfortunately we end up only getting one token there instead of the proper pack now we head across to the team this is a look at the updated team ron boone daryl griffith is now in the starting lineup glenn robinson darius miles is a new addition serge barker is a new addition trey young duncan robinson new addition Derek jones jr which is probably the next card i'm going to upgrade maybe to Kawhi or something like that. Kevin Love, which is still there, and Mitchell Robinson. Absolutely loving this lineup. I'm working towards Kyrie right now to replace Trey Young, but overall, really happy with the progress and really happy with how this team is going. A big thank you if you made it this far in the video. I uh, I know that this is different to other No Money Spent series, but I'm trying to do my own thing, trying to keep my, uh, keep my own kind of wave going, keep my own series going. So I appreciate you guys for watching this video. Uh, if you haven't seen on my Twitter, I released my content schedule for the next few weeks, for the next few months um, i'll basically be uploading videos a few times per week and streaming if you want to see that go across to the twitter have a look it is my pinned tweet there so you don't need a twitter account to view it you don't need to you don't need to have anything all you need to do is click the link in the description to my twitter profile and it'll come up as the first tweet when you scroll down a little bit so have a look at that if you're interested about when i'm uploading my videos or when i'm streaming the only day i don't do content is monday uh, and every other day i'll be uploading either at 10 p.m or streaming from 12 p.m to 3 p.m australian eastern standard time so guys, thank you very much for watching this video. Let me know how your No Money Spend Squad is going down in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.